Let's play. We got another demo. This one needs access to everything. Sure. Take some access. Sell my data. I don't care. It's a game called Hans. Where you play as a watermelon. I think it's mouse and keyboard only. WASD to move. Space to jump. Right mouse to slow-mo. Mouse wheel to zoom. R to restart. All right, it's only up, but it's with a watermelon. Hey, Veronic. Paul, you got my attention. I love you too, Paul. You are incredible. The fire alarm going off all day is not incredible. Okay, so it's only up with a watermelon. And that's annoying. How am I supposed to get up there? Upgrades? What is this, a roguelite? Can this fire alarm chill? Karate hands? Sorry, Lodema. Jesus. We'll see if this gets on to the Let's Play channel. Dude. Dude! How are you supposed to make that jump? I'm already stuck in the first damn pump. Maybe you're not supposed to go up these. That wouldn't make any sense. But how are you supposed to go up this damn watermelon? Is the starting spot over here maybe, Bob? Wait, I can just restart. Never mind, I can't restart. The R button doesn't work. Let's just go back to the instructions. It's literally an only up. Oh, I was going the wrong way. An only up. I also went the wrong way at the start. Okay, this will be easy now. I don't know how I found this game. No, no, no! Oh my god. Dude, what the fuck? This is a demo as well. Everything I'm playing is a demo. This one doesn't have a release date though, but... I could just make the easiest clickbait title ever. Only up, but with a watermelon? Get that surprise face in there. Ah! Turn my face into a watermelon for it. Zaz. Yeah, it's only up, but with a watermelon, and it's a lot more frustrating than only up was. But this is only a demo of the game, because it's in the Steam Next Fest. I might DM it to Chloe and be like, here you go. Here's the next game for you. Only up. But with a watermelon. Play the demo. It's called Hans, H-A-N-S. I'll let somebody else make the clickbait video of only up but with a watermelon. Oh, 
Oh. You could slow down time, but that's it. I'm sure the dev just spawned himself high up in the ground when making the tutorial. Because nobody can get past this. gone through the torture of only up once. I don't need to go through it again. But I am. Baby. Oh, baby! Only up but fruit? Yep, it's literally only up but with a watermelon. Only up seems to have spawned some, uh, some inspiration, it seems. That's my fire alarm going off. They've, they've been testing it for four hours and they're going to test it for another four hours. What a great day to get no sleep. Fucking God, dude. I'm so bad at this. The shortest stream. Yeah, plus me and Kat have stuff we need to do. We need to go get... We need to pick Nami up in five hours. This is a game we didn't know we need and we actually don't need. Yeah. I will say, it's kind of funny. It's just only up with a watermelon. I can see this game taken off, like, as a meme. But... I will say, I'm, I, this is already very frustrating. This is already very frustrating, but... I gotta see where this demo ends. Harder than only up? Oh my god. The hardest only up clone ever? There's the title. But I'm not going to make a video like that. Any content creators? There you go. Ludwig will probably make that video in like three days. When you see this game blow up, just remember. Your streamer man found it first. But didn't capitalize on the market gain. Looking handsome as fuck with the hat, glasses, and beard. Thank you. I need to get new glasses, actually. I might actually finally... I found an eye doctor that's actually really close that takes walk-ins. So I might just walk in one day and say, can I schedule an eye exam, please? And they'll be like, do you have insurance? I'll be like, no, take all my money. Because I think I really need to get my eyes checked out. Apparently, stuff's not supposed to be blurry far away. To a certain point, stuff is blurry. I couldn't even read the fucking time on the oven clock this morning. I was like eight feet away from it.
An extremely good sight coming from a family of all glasses. I was supposed to be the one that wasn't going to get glasses because my mom and both my brothers have glasses. And I was the one that didn't have glasses growing up. The eye goop? I can promise you it's not the eye goop. Because I don't think I had eye goop at 8 o'clock when I got back from taking Stormy to the vet. Not Stormy, not me. I've been doing this for 11 minutes of my life. Oh my goodness. God damn watermelon. Oh. Might be the worst demo I've ever played. <laughs> Who decided to make this? Who did this? Who did this? Who decided to make a physics based game with a watermelon in the style of Only Up and have the audacity to call it a psychological horror? The eye boogers are just like the. the the ear waxy feeling stuff that you get in your eyes when you wake up. That's the best way I can describe it. I don't know if the, what the medical term is for it. Why do this? I saw it and I was curious. Bro. This is only up with a watermelon. hate Landorus Phoenix. I hate those three Pokemon. The Tornadus and Landorus. Oh god, they're so ugly. Oh! Oh, baby. Dude, how was I supposed to make that? Grayscale uh, slows down time so you can like land the watermelon a little bit easier. Watch out, here comes here comes that melon. Here he comes. We potentially have two job interviews. Let's fucking go throw. Hopefully part-time. Part-time, let's go. 
this is so sad. Can we get 10 melons? Bro, dude, oh my god, Jesus Christ. Watermelon. Looking at myself in the OBS window and thinking the back how I looked three years ago. If you told me I'd be bald, have glasses, wear dad hats all the time, and wear this in Canada, I'd be like, no shot, I'd have hair. I feel like even just like a few years ago, I looked so damn young compared to now. Am I crazy? Have I have I aged in the past few years with natural aging? Because I swear I've looked the fucking same forever. Now I just looked at myself and I was like, wow, I really do look different. God, does that just happen? Does that just happen at one point in your life? You just look at you just look at yourself and you're like, shit, what happened? Wait a minute. Like, I just looked over, I was like, wait a minute. Is this really what I look like now? Is that just what time does? You're just like, oh, God. You hung out with a bunch of 18-year-olds today. Did you like it? I'd feel so old if I hung out with an 18-year-old. Did they use TikTok a lot? You did look like a baby when I first started watching. That was like, what, just a little over three years ago? Three and a half now, probably? Now I don't look like a baby. Like, if I pull up a clip from three and a half years ago, I have clips from three and a half years ago. And just... Clips. Baby face bird. I got a clip from me eight years ago. Google Smegma. This was three years ago. Yo, NGB Fong is gifting us up the Smegma princess. That was me. Three and a half years ago. They looked so old, right? Whatever that means. Dude, look at all the subs I had. 1700 subs. How are you doing? Yup, yup, there it is. 
There it is. I don't know. That's barely even baby face, right? Well, if you look at the microphone, I had a, a AT2020 USB, not a condenser mic that I have now. I have a... I was a little hyper little shit back then, but my voice is definitely different. Because I have the qual... I didn't have a good mic at this time. Ready for an iconic sound? Ew, what are you doing? Ew, what are you doing? I mean, if you want to see really young. Unlock. Do I want to open this? I think the... I want the, uh... Ran 18 year old me. I was 18 in this clip. That sounds pretty cool. Why are we watching a toddler, right? Like, there's not even a shadow. There's not even a shadow. Look at the bottom. Look at the bottom. There's not even a shadow on that face. This was 18-year-old me streaming. Unlocking shadow daggers. And not knowing what they were because I didn't play CSGO. I just wanted to gamble. I look so young. I was 18. I was 18. Literally none of you were in this chat then besides Alex. And Alex is not even in here right now. Alex and Flair, maybe Cypher was in here, Yachts. There's only a few people that were watching this stream then. I had hair! Dude, I had hair. Look at that hairline. That's the hairline of an 18-year-old kid. I Doesn't know what he's getting himself into. I had no hair on my face. It switched places. There's that. You've been here for a long fucking time. Long fucking time. That was 70 months ago. 70 plus months ago. That was before I even had a sub button. That was before the affiliate program existed on Twitch. As some people would quote it, those were the good old days of Twitch. I don't think those were the good old days of Twitch. I think those were bad days on Twitch. Because it was very hard to be a full-time content creator. To get partner, you had to average 500 fucking viewers. Are you kidding me? Why are you playing only up as a watermelon? I saw this as a game demo and I just had to try it. I saw it as a demo. I had to try it. They were days. I don't think they were good days on Twitch. Like, it was fun to stream because, you know, not many people knew what streaming was. Like, I remember when I was working at a job, I told my coworkers I started streaming on Twitch. Because, you know, they, they liked video games as well. And they are like, what's Twitch? And then I told them, I was like, I just, you know, stream video games. And they are like, people watch that? I was like, yeah, I guess. I was like, I'm playing the games anyways. I was like, I might as well stream. I'm like, oh, that's kind of cool. And then they went back talking about Skyrim because Skyrim was still kind of hot then. This was 2015. Hey, Witch Queen. How you doing? Yeah, Devil, back then it was weird. Now it's much more normalized, I feel. Because it's much more common to see this as a full-time job for a lot of people. Guess it depends on who you're talking to, though. Skyrim came out in 2013? 2013? 2012? I think 13. Was it the first game to win Game of the Year at the Game Awards, or was that Dragon Age Origins? 2011? Oh, Jesus. Oh, my fucking God. 2011? That's when you graduated high school. That's when I got into high school. Because I graduated in 2015.
graduated in 2001. I was four. I wonder, is there anyone in the high school in this chat? Don't actually, don't tell me that. I don't want to know. Don't tell me that shit. Don't tell me that shit. I don't want to know if you're in high school. Don't ruin my illusion. My illusion is you're all 35. You're all 35 with responsibilities and bills. Two thousand one seemed like so much fun. Well, two thousand one, you didn't have the ease of the internet, but well, you did have the ease of the internet. But it wasn't really uh, popular as it is today. Not ever. Nobody had cell phones. Probably, probably rich people had cell phones in two thousand one. You can even out the average. <laughs> You had clothes and sick music? Well, I mean, we have clothes today. The iPhone came out in 2007? That's weird. I remember having an iPod Touch and playing Doodle Jump and watching the bench warmers because I bought it for $5 with an iTunes gift card. And also buying, watching the same four Futurama episodes because those are the only ones my iPod could handle because I had so many damn stupid games on there. If I didn't have a game downloaded, I'd have to go on the school Wi-Fi to download it. <gasps> we made it to this! Oh, fucking hell. Yeah, the lightsaber apps, the lighter apps, the gun apps, the apps that just shot guns. They were free, so you had them, because you took any free app you could get. Don't fall on me, you son of a bitch. Oh my god. Oh! Haunts. What the fuck was that? A fart app? Yup. A flashlight app? I've learned to not give quite a fuck what anyone thinks and I'm quite happy to live your life. That's the way I'm living my life. Which is why I'm streaming only up watermelon style. And losing my sanity. The best game was Zumbinis. I asked Kat if she ever played Zumbinis in school, and she was like, what's Zumbinis? And I was like, oh my god, Canadian. What did the Canadian education system do to you if they didn't give you Zumbinis? I have Zumbinis on Steam, actually. I remember when they brought Zumbinis to Steam, I downloaded it, like, instantly. <laughs> Played Club Penguin and Pokemon in school. When I was in high school, I was the only one that knew how to use an emulator. So I downloaded Pokemon on my phone, and everyone was like, Oh my god, how did you do that? And then, like, two days later, one of the popular kids came in with Pokemon on their phone. And then they were like, oh my god, you have Pokemon on your phone. And then everyone started playing Pokemon on their phone. And then everyone was like, yeah, the popular kid did it first. And I was like, you motherfuckers, I did it first because you guys are too stupid to know how to do it. They installed an Amazon locker in the apartment complex. Well, like, one of those, like, snail things that, like, the Amazon people throw the package in, then they give you a code to open it. Because they can't walk up a flight of stairs, because they're so busy.
We have one of those in our apartment, and I hate it. Because if I buy something off a throne, or someone buys something off a throne, how am I supposed to get the code for it? Doesn't make any sense. A smartphone in high school? I had a very bad smartphone in high school. When TikTok, or not TikTok, TikTok didn't exist in my, my high school. That's when Twitter was becoming popular. Was that your doing, la la la? I hope it was. I hate the snail mail. Those Amazon snail mail things, they're the goddamn worst. Just deliver the package. I don't like it. I don't like it. Because uh, my package got stuck in there. And then I had to go out to the other building to grab it. Maybe tweet by texting a number. What was that texting service where you texted the, like a number and they gave you like a random fact? Okay. Only up watermelon. Oh, Shut up, only up watermelon. We're done with you. YouTube Let's Play. Enjoy only up watermelon, I hope.